driver is great down there and the banter is good uh, working side with a good few Kilkenny people as well so it's 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 great and everyone is looking forward to the game I think because I suppose for two traditional teams in Hurland Tip and Kilkenny we haven't met too often you know and it's what it's 18 19 years I think since Tip and Kilkenny met in All Ireland again so there's great anticipation and you know I know down below you know everyone is by saying that Kilkenny you know have a you know should should be winning it but I know all Tip folk and all of us in Tip are saying you know we're, we're digging into the history and the tradition down there and we, we have a great record against Kilkenny in All Ireland so he'll be saying you know that, that might carry him through on the day to win a game like that particularly in the semi-final to come out and you know they played exhibition stuff that day and you know Limerick put you know didn't didn't put any fight together at all um, but I'm sure that the lads themselves know that it's an all-iron final it, it needs no motivation to be playing Kilkenny they've been the best team in the country for the last number of years and they're not taking that away from them but you know it's down to a two-horse race now the all-iron final it's going to be a massive occasion and you'll be hoping that the guys can uh, uh, peak for, for, for the one day like for the whole parish in Mullahone at that time you know we were always so close on the border and it's the first time that probably the parish had somebody representing themselves uh, on, on the Tipperary team as well whereas we have two lads on, on, on next Sunday as well so that, it's going to be great but back in 91 I just I can still kind of picture it. it's so hard to believe that it's uh, 18, 19 years ago I don't know where the years went but like they're a great time after it and the build up at that time was you know on the border areas with Mullahone, Callan then up around Orlingford um, and that would have been uh, it would have been great like and I'm sure it's no different around this time there'll always be the bit of banter you know and you know you'd be just saying it like you know you're here today and you're looking at how fabulous Crow Park is you know and I suppose never got to play on the new Crow Park